times as big as a man. Today, before I finish off the King Kong review series with the final review episode, today I'm going to be discussing the lost episodes of the show. Now, there's two kind of categories here. So there are the incomplete episodes, and then there are the ones that are lost, as in there is no existing footage of them, as far as I know. So, first, I'm going to go over the episodes that uh, are non-existent. So, the first one, The Legend of Loch Ness. That sounds pretty cool. No Man's Snowman. The Desert Pirates. I would have loved to see some pirates. The Sea Surrounds Us. Showbiz. That sounds really stupid. The Wizard of Overlord. Perilous Purpoise. What? Diver's Dilemma. Kong is Missing. Oh no. In the land of the giant trees. That's some kind of a uh, Lord of the Rings shit. <laughs> Captain Kong. That's pretty cool. Statue of Liberty play. What? Well, if you went back to New York, that would have been pretty cool. Pandora's box. Desert City. Eagle Squadron. It wasn't there again today. What a... <laughs> That's like the weirdest name ever. And the actual final episode of the show, which would have come after the King Kong Diamond, was called Anchors Away. So there are two episodes that are uh, existent, but I decided not to review them because they were about half the length of an episode. So there was some lost context there. But I'm just going to go over them quickly. So the first one is Dr. Bone. So again, only three minutes of this one exists, and it's only in Spanish. So there's a crazy doctor who has his fossil museum, he has like a dinosaur and everything, and he wants to kill Kong, so I guess he can take his bones and reconstruct them and add them to his museum. So uh, he also has like a little pet crow, I guess. So he gets to the island somehow and sets up this mirror. He runs away as Kong comes, Kong grabs some bananas, but he sees himself in the mirror, and Dr. Bone, you know, while Kong's distracted, he shoots this gas at Kong, which makes him pass out. He drags Kong away. They get to the shore, and they drop Kong in this raft. Bobby and Sue are on the beach, and they spot Kong, and they run back to their dad, but at the same time, Dr. Boone cuts the rope, and he and uh, Kong float away. Great ending, and it's just like that. The next one is called Command Performance. This one is weird. Kong is at some kind of orchestra show. There's some plan from this eye patch guy to use Kong as a distraction so that they can abduct the queen and prime minister who are going to be at the show. Uh... The show begins and Kong's big stunt is lifting the orchestra in the air as they play. Uh, the men fool the cops by using their like fake cops to get into the room uh, with the queen and they have her at gunpoint. Kong sees this and he gets angry. So uh, but then he lifts the orchestra all the way up and we see the queen is leaving. So Kong goes one handed and tries to grab uh, the eye patch guy with the other hand. Uh, and, you know, he almost drops the orchestra, but he does grab the guy. He brings him down to the stage. Kong saves the day. The queen says he'll never be forgotten. So there was certainly some stuff that they were working on in the show, some episodes that um, seemed pretty interesting. So those were the lost episodes. And, yeah, I mean, certainly would have loved to see the Loch Ness Monster and another New York episode. So what do you guys think of all that? I don't know. See you in the final review. Oh, kinky! <laughs> King Kong, you know the name of King Kong, you know the name of King Kong, you know the fame of King Kong, ten times as big as a man.